All right, guys, our 97 Chevy's gonna get an oil change now. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. You're gonna need a 15 millimeter wrench and a full can of beans. All right, guys, so I'm under the driver door here and here's the frame and right here's our oil filter. They should be able to just push the dang thing loose. No, oh, I gotta get under there more. Excuse me. You take this 15 millimeter, loosen up that drain plug. It's stuck 40 times because the last person gummed it up. Usually they come out smoother than this. This one wants to be difficult. But that is okay. Because we are mightier than the stupid drain plug. And there you go. That all right there is drained. Go ahead and get our oil filter all. Yeah, you can grab it. There we go. There it goes. Very nice. So wait for that to drain. Once it's all drained out, put the plug back in, take the filter all the way off. The trick we do in all of our oil change videos, you want to take some of that oil on your hand and lube up this gasket real good on the oil filter. Because if you don't do that, it's going to get stuck on there and you're never going to get the damn thing back off. The last step is to get yourself some 5W30 because this 350 takes 5 quarts of 530 here. So it says right on the fill cap. So you put five of these in there using big red funnel and uh, you should be good to go. So let's add them now. Two, ah, ah, ah. You get the point. You put five in there, crank it up, give a new oil change sticker, and uh, tell them everything else is wrong in the truck. Look it over, check all the fluids, keep a good 27-point inspection. 